So I was chatting with another marketer the other day and we got into this deep conversation about the challenges of getting people who have downloaded your app to actually use it. It's not easy, right? I mean, we've put all this effort into driving app installs, but then it becomes a struggle to engage users and make conversions happen. Well, here's the exciting part and the reason we're here today, to share the solution, deep linking. In the next few minutes, we'll explore how to transform your customer experience and turn those downloads into engaged app users. But first, let's understand what deep linking is all about. Deep linking allows users to navigate directly to specific content within your mobile app, bypassing unnecessary steps on their way to the content they want to see. Think of it as your app's personalized GPS. It guides users directly from wherever they are online, for example, social media or a website, to exactly where they want to go inside your app. So you might be wondering, how does it all work? Well, with the help of deep linking technology, you can create better experiences for existing app users, as well as for those yet to download your app. Picture this, a current user of your shopping app clicks on your ad and is directed straight to the discounted shoes they've been eyeing, while a potential user is directed to download your app first, then whisked off to the discounted shoes. Pretty seamless for both users, right? Now let's dive into how deep linking can help you tackle some key challenges you might be facing as a marketer. You know, the usual suspects like persuading users to download your app or alternatively, getting them to engage with it again for whatever reason. So let's start there. How can you use deep links to drive re-engagement? Let's look at some practical examples. A travel app can wake up dormant users by sending them an email with a deep link to special offers on flights. A gaming app could take a different approach and send its users a personalized bonus via SMS with a deep link that takes them straight to a virtual gift that boosts their gaming experience. In the case of a health and fitness app, a deep link integrated into a social media post can navigate users to a new workout series or offer within the app. Now, if you're in e-commerce, cart abandonment might be one of your biggest headaches. Did you know that about 70% of shopping carts are abandoned at checkout? The reality is users often fill their carts but get distracted before they hit the buy now button. We've all been there. This is where deep linking comes to the rescue. A simple reminder email with a deep link can take them directly back to their abandoned cart, re-engaged and ready to check out with one single click. Okay, let's switch gears for a moment and discuss how you can convert potential users into new app users. Convincing web users to download your app can be tough. It requires a compelling value proposition. So how about using smart banners? Picture this. A user is reading a recipe on your mobile site, planning their dinner for the same evening. Suddenly, a smart banner catches their attention, urging them to purchase the ingredients through your app with a tempting discount. Intrigued, they tap on the smart banner with a deep link, which whisks them away to the app store. Then once they've downloaded your app, they land straight on the checkout page, ready to finalize the order. Pretty smooth, right? Now, what about those potential users who aren't always online? How can you bring them on board? The key lies in making potential users aware of your app and showing them why they absolutely need it. Let's take an in-store shopper who sees a special promotion on a digital screen. To get it, they scan a QR code. That single scan takes them directly to the specific offer within your app. So now you know how deep linking creates better customer experiences and boost engagement, let's explore the top five best practices for your campaigns. One, make sure the context of your content is relevant to the user's overall experience so it matches their intent. Two, if you're looking to get users from point A to point B, point B being your app, throw in a little incentive to give them the extra push they need. Three, Measure the impact of the experiences you create. Analyzing the engagement and conversions attached to a specific campaign can help you to understand what works, what doesn't, and optimize to improve performance. Four, re-engage your dormant users, and when you do, make sure deep links are there to make their experience seamless. Five, last but not least, 
Brand your links. Savvy users will think twice before clicking on generic URLs that don't fit your brand identity. So there you have it. You're now prepared to use deep linking in your marketing campaigns to boost your customer experience, improve engagement and drive more app conversions. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments below and we'll get them answered for you. In the meantime, stay tuned and subscribe to our channel as we have a ton more videos lined up created to help you get better app marketing results. Thanks for watching and see you next time.